back again. We're back again. Look at us. Look at us. <laughs> Who would have thought? Who would have thought? Like, not, <laughs> not us. Not me. Because we were like, <laughs> we're doing it bi-weekly. And we're back on the old set show. I, I do feel like I need to point out that bi-weekly means twice a week. Does it? Yeah. What, what, what is it? Bi-monthly. You get two in a month. It's like, you know, English is hot. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, do you want to introduce our lovely little podcast? Yeah, right then. Hi, everyone. Welcome to all the films we judged before. I'm Katie. That's Lily Kay. And we're done. Uh, done. Do you that see how I just sort of oh, I, I jumped into it? Because otherwise I, I get I get too in my head about it. it it's yeah. a whole... You were very quick. Well done. <laughs> well done. That's us. Uh, all right. We're going to have uh, some games today. Uh, Katie <laughs> loves games. Uh, I do love games. I, I get love... nervous when you tell me things like, we're going to do a game. I'm not going to tell you anything. <laughs> I'm like... <laughs> <laughs> what's the fun in it then if i tell you what it is uh i will tell you this much that we already played this game once okay. and uh, i want to do it again because it was fun uh but first i'm gonna ask you what did you watch what did i watch what did i watch <laughs> I don't really, I don't know. i'm not i've been watching i remember watching the sandman i think i mentioned that last time yes you did little bits and pieces i'm not doing it like particularly quickly i'm just yeah going in. Bits and pieces. I watched. Um, I rewatched um, Sound of Her Wings the other day, and oh boy, I've seen that episode more than the rest of them. It just, it, I don't know if it was the time of day or I got really got me <laughs> that time. <laughs> it's just fucking hell. I mean, it's, it's I already, you know, it's an excellent episode, but fuck, yeah, fuck, you know, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. um, but yeah. I haven't really. I've not really been watching stuff. I've been replaying The Witcher Three. Mm-hmm. Not replaying. I've been gone. I've gone back to The Witcher Three because yeah. uh, I'm going through Blood and Wine, mm-hmm. um, poking around, saving knights. Yeah. Just you know how how just being <laughs> the Witcher. I'm being the Witcher. I'm, I'm I'm just doing Geralt things. As as Geralt does, spending all my money desperately trying to upgrade my <laughs> school of the cat armor. It's so expensive. <laughs> and it's not it's not that. even gonna it's not even gonna be the best armor I have by the time I've actually managed to like upgrade it properly. But I'm already halfway there and I can't stop at this point. There you go. There you go. You can do it. That's fine. I'm getting there. But I don't, I've not really been watching a whole lot, really. I don't, what have you been watching? I'm just gonna... okay. Uh, I watched Missing finally. Uh, the is, uh, the, the new woman... movie from the oh. Searching Universe. I don't. Oh know right. Uh, fucking rain. I, I I was wondering if it was Searching. I've forgotten what the Searching it was, was called, it was, but like it was. It was. I rewatched that as well yesterday, actually. But, searching uh, was good. I like that movie. Yeah. It's really good. Missing is even better, which I never thought would be pos- uh, possible, but it is. Uh. I was dumbfounded by it. I was like, yeah, oh my God, yes, that's how you do it. Fucking loved every minute of it. So, yeah, highly recommend Missing. Uh, it's really good. And I, I realized that I really like this whole uh, replaying the whole movie on the computer kind of thing. It's uh, a fun bit. It is. It's really good. It's really fun. Uh, I... makes, makes you want to turn on your computer and just do random shit. <laughs> <laughs> the NSA person watching my computer things will be very entertained. Very good. Uh, I also rewatched uh, one of the best horrors in this genre, uh, on Unfriended, The Dark Web, which is like very creepy. <laughs> like, very, very creepy. I was like, oh, I forgot how creepy this movie is. <laughs> <laughs> so good, so good. And I just found out that the guy who's the uh, who plays the main character in that is now going to be in the John Wick series as uh, the young, um, um, not John Wick. <laughs> oh God, names. Uh, it's very hot in here, so I can't think straight. I, I've only seen the first one. I don't know anybody's names. Uh, uh, the Continental is going to be the uh, name of the series. Mm. And he plays the young, my, doesn't it come to me? I hate myself sometimes. Yeah. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm googling the wrong things. I have no idea. 
I will find it. Hold on. Don't don't start the trailer. Shut up. Uh, uh, the young Winston Scott. That's the one. Winston. Fucking hell. Uh, it was played by Shane Black in John Wick. Okay. Yeah, there you go. Bless you. Uh, oh, yeah, so sorry. Yeah. Uh, I rewatched that, and then I watched Missing. Um, what else did I watch? Did I watch anything else? Nope. That's all. That's that's all. That's all. That's, that's all. all I watched. That's it. It is. It is what it is. You know, I, I I I didn't have time to watch movies. I'm not gonna lie. Like this, we we had like a singing camp uh, for the weekend. We had mm. a, a performance as well. So I'm like, I'm very tired <laughs> and all over the place. <laughs> I'm seeing next to normal. Well, when by the time this comes out, I will have seen it already. But as of the day we're recording this, I'm seeing it tomorrow. I'm so go. excited. I bet you are. I'm so bet excited. And I'm going by myself. This is the first time I've gone to the theatre by myself. It would be oh. nice. Little little trip on my own. There you go. Not intentional. Just that I could only get one ticket. <laughs> yeah. Fair. It's still going to be fun. I'm it's sure going to be a really good time. I'm going to cry throughout the whole thing. So I did Probably. the first time. Yeah. Not the whole thing, actually. There was a bit there was a good half an hour at the beginning that I didn't cry at the first time. And but then there's 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 a there's a certain revelation in the story uh <laughs> that uh, that uh, pops up about half an hour in and then I cried for the rest of the thing. There you go. <laughs> what what a fun thing to watch then. <laughs> oh, it's it's it is genuinely really, really, really good. I'm very excited to see uh, especially Jack Wolf be uh oh, Jack Wolf, yes. Uh yes. Um Playing the character that Aaron Tveit, um played on Broadway. Nice. I I um I shouldn't be surprised that he can sing, but I've not heard him sing yet, so this should be interesting. Mm, interesting, interesting. All right, that sounds like fun. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Uh, yeah. Uh, all right. Should we get into playing games then? Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. So the first game we're going to play is the one we already played. Uh, I'm going to list uh, actors. Mm, I thought uh, this would be it. Yeah. Uh, and then, you know, you have to figure out which movie I am talking about. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. A little brain game. I don't know. Who who did we play with? Did we play with Yuri? No. It was no. somebody else. Was it now? I don't remember who it was, though. I think we played it with Yuri. I just have this sneaky feeling. That... Oh, maybe we did. Maybe it was the first time. Me, yeah, I think so. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. So much time has passed since then. <laughs> if, if we find it, it's going to be in the description, so you can watch us playing this game again, uh, with different movies. Duh. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're right. It was. It. I think it was. I think it was Yuri. Right. Yeah. Yeah, I think so too. It's really, it was really fun. It was really fun. All right. So. Let's start with the first one. I'm going to reveal two actors at the very beginning and then only one uh, if if you need more clues. So the first two actors are Wes Bentley and my boy, Carl Urban. Wes, Wes, Bentley. Wes, Wes Bentley. I don't know who that is. Oh, that's great. It's a good start. <laughs> it's uh... a good start. <laughs> he was in the in the Hunger Games. He was the. Can uh, I can I look him up to see see what he looks like? Yes. You can you can look him up. That's. But don't don't look at. No, I'm not looking anything else. I just want to see what he looks like. (laughs) Okay, yeah, no. When when you said the the guy in the Hunger Games, that's what I thought. Yeah, Um, and then Carl Urban is the is the second name. Carl Urban is the second one. Um, well, whatever this movie is, I haven't seen it, so that's Mm. a good start. That's a good start. I can just I can tell. Maybe you can you can still figure it out. I can tell already. Uh, I mean, I don't currently have. What movies has Carl Urban been in? The only thing that comes to mind is Star Trek. <laughs> <laughs> That's the things he's been in. <laughs> I know he's been in so many things. I just don't think I've really seen him in anything else. Like, oh, other is... than The Boys. Like, like, you know. Fair, fair. Uh, I'm going to go on then and say that uh, the next name is Rupert Redford. Fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> Did I help you? No, I, I don't think I've got a concept. I'm just trying to. I'm. I'm narrow. What do we think? Is this what early two thousands or is it relatively recent? Uh, I would say it is kind of recent. Kind of last 
It's Last not early decade? 2000s. That's 100%. Okay. But like... It's like the 16, 2016. All right. I will help you this 2016. Okay. 2016. 2016. Yes. Um, uh. Should I give you another name? Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. the next name is Bryce Dallas Howard. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Huh? She was the main character, I can tell you this much as well. One of the main characters in it. One of the main characters. 2016. Mm-hmm. Rose Howard. That's really annoying. I can't. Annoyingly, every day I just keep thinking about Black Mirror, and that's not helpful. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's not helpful uh, and yet that's all that's in my brain um, the, the other clue I can give you is that it is an adap- adaptation of a beloved classic it's <laughs> <laughs> good podcast content I don't know <laughs> should I just reveal what it is please reveal what it is it's Pete's dragon Oh, yeah, no, I wouldn't have gotten that in a million fucking years. <laughs> well, it's uh, it was the first one. I love uh, that movie. Like, I, yeah, that that was that's that's not a movie that's I I I remember the name and I do remember it coming out. Yes. Not in my radar. <laughs> no, not at no. all. You didn't see it. Nope. <gasps> I love Peace Dragon. It's so wonderful. <laughs> Just wonderful. All right, uh, we're going to jump onto the next one. Let's do this. Uh, <laughs> the first two name I'm going to say is Jenna Ortega. Okay. And the other one is Jack Quaid. Scream. Fuck. <laughs> yes, sorry, easy. sorry. Five, five cream. <laughs> <laughs> five scream. <laughs> that was too easy. I went easy on you. Mm. Should've, should should've you should have held it. To be fair, the moment you said Jenna Ortega, I was like, well, it's you one just... of the screen movies. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Easy peasy. <laughs> All right. Uh, then we are going to jump into your way, maybe. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let's do this one next. Uh, <laughs> I'm... <laughs> I had to think about it. <laughs> um, so, All right. Oh, my God. There are names here that I don't even know. That's This is going to be fun. Good, good um, for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, the first two names is uh, Johnny Miller. Okay, good stuff. Uh, and the other one is Alexander Ludwig. Alexander Ludwig. Mm-hmm. Hmm. I did. Mm-hmm. I was looking at Johnny Miller's um, filmography a lot recently. So <laughs> this is Ooh. well, you know, because I was watching Elementary. I know. Um, I know. Uh, and obviously Train Spotting. Um, yes. Is this? Is this an old film? No. Very new? Um, yeah, you can say it's very new. Hmm. What was mm. he in recently? Should I give you another name? Yeah, give me another name. Anthony Starr. This is this is where the trouble is going to be for all the people who I, I say all the people <laughs> to the people who don't watch the video version. I'm making faces. Yes, it's um, they are glorious. Faces. I'm making I'm, just, I'm making faces. I'm I didn't I I didn't know they were in a movie together. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's a new movie, so like you know, like really new. Yeah, I would say it's really new. Yeah, if you consider okay, one more clue. 2023 really new. Yeah, that's really new. That's that is that is inherently very new. Yep. But it's mm-hmm. already out and and it's like, you know, it's not in the cinemas or anything, so it's been out for a while now. I don't know what this is. Um it's not an animated movie, is it? It's not. No. It's like so. a live action. Proper drama. Yeah. Yes. I don't think I know what this is. What if I say the next thing? Okay. Jake Gyllenhaal. Oh, this isn't one of those. That, Jake Gyllenhaal's done a bunch of fucking war movies recently. It's not, is it? Mm-hmm. 
Is this the one that was, the right track. I can't remember what it's called, but it was the one that was on Amazon, wasn't it? Yep. <sighs> and it has a very famous director as well. No, Guy Ritchie's doing the other one. Nope, that's the one. No, it is? Yeah. Well, that was right, because he's done like two, and they're both <laughs> like, they, they both look very similar. <laughs> um, it's the Covenant. <laughs> that's it, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's a very good movie. Highly recommend. I don't think I knew that Johnny Miller was in that. And there you go. He's in it. Um, Because the the thing's getting me confused is that Guy Ritchie's also done another movie that's also about like war that's not out yet. Um, which is the ungentle the 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 something about ungentlemanly warfare or something like that. Yes, yes, yes. Um, and yes, ungentlemanly warfare. The Ministry of Ungentlemanly Warfare, which that's not out until next year. Exactly, but I'm talking about. But you're talking about the now. government. Yes, and uh, Guy Ritchie did that. Uh, uh, it's 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 a really good movie. Uh, all right, uh, I'm gonna jump uh, to the next one, which is gonna be any mini mini move. Okay, let's go with uh, the show on. One <laughs> second, one second. It's very slow, but I'm getting there. It's, it's oh, the suspense. <laughs> right. <laughs> uh, so once again, we're starting with two names. One of them is Joel David Moore, and the okay. other is Luz Alonso. I don't know who either of those people are. <gasps> well, at least one of them. Should I? Yeah, the second one. What's that? What was the second one? Luz Alonso. Oh, is that um? Mother's milk. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. Don't. Yeah. Okay, that's fair. Um, Come on. You know who he is. Yeah, well, thank you. I've got there, but I don't know <laughs> what the movie is. Okay, uh, should I give you another name then? Yeah, also give me the first one again. <laughs> well, I have to go back for that. Joel David Moore. Okay, yeah, I definitely don't know who that is. Okay, then I'm going to say the next name is Giovanni Rubisi. God, you're giving me a bunch of names that I'm like, oh, like that That sounds familiar. I just can't picture a face. <laughs> so none of it is particularly helpful. because. It... <laughs> All right, I, I'm, I'm going to make your life a bit easier, but it's it's like a big giveaway. I'm going to say Michelle Ro- Rodriguez. Is that... Is is it what is it one of the new fast movies? Uh uh-uh. uh Okay. No, not that easy. I oh, know. Um. Yeah. It would be too easy. Hmm. 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 Should I make it even more easier? <laughs> well, I, but Michelle Rodriguez has been in a lot of movies. That's just that's that's true. I'm not going to argue, <laughs> and it doesn't help that I don't know who the other two people are. <laughs> All right, but you, you're surely going to know this one if I say Stephen Lang. Don't tell me you don't know. Who I Stephen know Lang the is. name Stephen Lang. I just can't remember what he looks like. <laughs> Come on, Katie. I'm looking up Stephen Lang. Okay, look up, look up his it, face. Is it Stephen or Stephen? Stephen. Lang. Right, yes, that guy. Yes. Ah, ah, I, I see, I see <laughs> something movement in the brain. Is it Avatar? It is. Okay. Yay! Woo! Round of yeah. applause. <laughs> that that's unhelpful for the context because you can't see half of those people's faces. That's that's not true. The only one I listed here is Les Alonso, who played today. So everyone else, you can see their faces. Okay. I also want to point out that I haven't seen the original Avatar. Since it came out in two thousand and nine, <laughs> uh, duh, but still, like you know, it's not that hard. All right, next one, and then I have one more after this. Uh, one second, one second. It's so this site is so fucking slow. I don't know why. Where is it? I like. I had the list the, together. I'd like to remind the audience that um, Avatar is not my special interest. That's sh- that's that's Lily's. Um. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> it's my interest. 
Oh, wait. Find the next one. Find the next one. Uh, okay. Two names. Mm. Jessica Saw. And the other one is Chase Crawford. Jessica, Jessica, what was what was the last name? Sor. How are you spelling that? Uh, S Z O H R. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and what was the other name again? Chase Crawford. Okay. You've gone on a you went on a boys thing, didn't you? You went on the... Ah, you forget it out. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's the cast of the boys. <laughs> Um, this isn't the cast of the boys, but you've, that's the through line. Yes. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> okay. Um, I don't know. I don't know if I've seen if I've seen Chase Crawford in any other properties. So this should be interesting. But if I say Pan Badgley, I don't know. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> You don't um, know who that is? <laughs> no, I know who that is. I just okay. don't know if I've seen him. I like in anything because I don't. I, I mean, I haven't even watched you. I didn't watch Gossip Girl when it was out, so I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what if I say Blake Lively? Oh, well, the first thing that comes to mind when I think of Blake Lively is um fucking. Uh, what's it called? The one with um Anna, what's her face? What? <sighs> simple something. Simple. One. What simple one? I can't. A simple something. <laughs> it's, it's not the one. It's not yeah. the one we're looking for here. What is the one I'm thinking of? A simple favor. That's the uh... favor. Yeah. yeah. No, it's yeah. not the one. Not that one. Have I seen? But Blake Lively was also in Gossip Girl. That's the one. <laughs> Gossip Girl's a series. I know. I needed to sneak that in there. That's not fair. That's... <laughs> Why? <laughs> because you changed the rules of the game without telling me. Well, whoops. <laughs> but you figured it out. I also said that a second ago. <laughs> yeah, but I couldn't say yes when you, you know, you just mentioned it. You were like, Gossip Girl. Mm. Oh, all right. The last one on this list. Um, uh, hold on. Again, why are you slow? Slow. What are you doing? What are you doing? There you go. Getting there. One second. I've diminished in the stream. I need to sit up. <laughs> <laughs> um. All right. Uh, the first two names. A very surprising ones because I don't even remember. Uh, David Harbour. You know, David Harbour. Mm. Uh, and the next one is Common. Mm. I watched David Harbour's interview with Ali Plum the other day. Mm. So I wonder if this is one of the ones that was mentioned in there. Is this? Is this a series? No. Okay. Well, that can get rid of that part of my brain. So, um, well, he was in Quantum of Solace, so we'll start there. Nope. Um, well, I'm not sure then. All right, then the next name is Jay Hernandez. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is just you giving me a bunch of names that I don't have, like, facial context for. You can you can look up his face. J. That's that says hey J. Hernandez and Hernandez. Hmm. Yeah, he's very familiar. I just don't. Mm. We're getting somewhere. One more name. One more name. Yeah. There's plenty of names here, so you can. Mm. Karen Fukuara. Bright. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um. David Harbour. Is this, is this a particularly old movie or is it? No, no, not old. Not old. Very new? No, very new. It's like, once again, I think it's 2016 again. Okay. It should be, yeah, 2016. 2016. What is this I'm guy doing? I'm, yes. I'm going through all the movies that they went through in the, the, the interview that he did. Um, 
there was, there was like some drama one that had um uh, Catherine be, Hahn. To, to be fair, David Harbour was in it, but for like a very short time. Well, okay. Who are the other names again? <laughs> Jay Hernandez. Yeah. Uh, Common. Right. Cara and Fukuara. I have to remind myself what the American rapper Common looks like. Oh, yeah, that's it. Common, who's also in it for like a short time. This is a movie with this. This is a movie with a lot of cameos in it, is it? Yeah, I wouldn't call them cameos, but yeah, like there's a lot of like people appearing for just, you know, randomly, basically. Yeah, I I give you another name. Yeah. All right. Uh, Jai Courtney. That is also a name. Oh. <laughs> no. No, that would be the wrong year. Why? What, I was what? thinking about Suicide Squad, but that's... That's the one. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yes, because he plays... Okay. <laughs> he's in both of them, he's if, in... if you were confused by he's, them. <laughs> he's in both of them. Yeah, there we go. Yep. Yeah, yeah, it, it is the suicide squad. It was the first role for Karen Fukuhara as well. Hmm. That's where she got discovered. So we had to, we had to mention it, even if the movie was bad. Stop seeing it. Yeah, that's fine. You didn't, you didn't. I'm not missing anything. No, that's no, bad. no, not at all. No. All right. So this was the first game. If you like, you know, didn't catch on. Katie said it. I like the. Previous person, I got, I got, I picked it up on it pretty quick. Yeah, you did, you did. It was, it was, you know, the cast members of the boys and uh, movies from them, and uh, Katie figured out quite a few. <laughs> quite a few. What? Don't make that face. You figured out quite a few there. Mm, yeah. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. <laughs> if you say so. I do. Uh, all right. Uh, the next game is not really. A game it's it's more like a what if situation okay so i'm gonna give you a movie mm-hmm. and uh, you will have to pick just one actor in there mm-hmm. and swap it with somebody else okay and that's it that's and and you can either explain or not explain why would you swap their places okay yeah yeah. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Mm-hmm. It can be a series as well, just putting it out there. Okay. Uh so the first one on my list, if I wouldn't have closed the window, it would be easier. I'm very on fire today. I don't know if you can tell. It's okay. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> okay. The first one is Guardians of the Galaxy. You can swap out one person, but the, only one. The the original, yeah? Yeah, the first the, the one. The first one. Yeah. I'm okay. looking up. Look up the cast. You obviously have the Chris Pratt, Zoe Saldana. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah you know, Dave Bautista, Karen yeah. Gillan. It's got yeah. a few people in there. Why do they swap out? Oh, we just swap out and with, with Do you know what? Just because yes. I saw a thing about this the other day. Okay. Um, Adam Brody. I think yes. It was Adam Brody. Now I have to double check that. <laughs> with the audition thing. Yeah, I saw that one as well. I think it was Adam Brody. Pretty Aud- sure. Auditioned for uh, Star for, for Star Lord. Yeah, I'd watch that. Really? Yeah, I would. Because I like quite like Adam Brody. He was in a movie I really enjoyed that I um recommended to everybody on this podcast a little while ago called mm. um Kid Detective. Yes, I remember. Uh, which is a great film. Mm. Small little thing. I really mm. uh, he's he's very good in it. Um, yeah. I highly recommend. I just think that that sounds. That sounds entertaining. I could see that. I, I'd, I'd watch that. <laughs> you know, that's fair. That's fair. Uh, all right. If I would have to choose yes. one person to, to swap out, clearly for, you know, for science for reasons, science. it would also be poor Chris Pan. Sorry, Chris. <laughs> I'm sorry. And I would swap him out with Chris Pine. Mm. Just for the fun of it, because mm. Chris Pine is a very funny guy. Okay, like yes, he his, his his comedy skills are like next level. So I would fucking love to see him as Star Lord. I think he would nail it as well. So why the yeah, fuck I not? could I could see it. I could see it. Yeah, I see yeah. It. 
right? All right, uh, that was a quick round. Uh, but what if I say La La Land? Mm. 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 Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. We have she Amazon says, and Ryan Gosling. Obviously. Yes, well, that's obvious. I don't think I, I, I think that, I don't think I'd swap them. <gasps> you wouldn't swap them. Interesting. No, I don't think I would. Mm. I quite like them in those, those roles. It's um, it's hard to tell because there's not really a whole lot else. I mean, they are like the main mm. characters, so you know, it's not an easy question. No, my my go to, I won't lie, is is John Legend but I also mm -hmm. don't know who I'd replace him with okay, okay. <laughs> um you'd need like another like excellent mu musician mm. that's you know but who that's a good question what let's see if I can get some inspiration well, if we would be living in a world where Ray Charles is still alive, then Ray Charles, I would say. Yeah, that's that's a good one, actually. Mm. Well, he's yeah, he's not with us anymore, which is very sad. He's great, 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 great music. Yeah, I really don't know. <laughs> I just... Someone for someone new, someone um uh uh. What's the guy's name in Hamilton? Um. Oh, Leslie Odom Jr. Yeah, that's a really good choice, actually. Mm -hmm. I like that choice. Right. I think. Yeah, I'm great. gonna. I'm. I think that that's a really good one. I think that that right there. Yeah. 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 Living with Dad. Yeah. Great. For, I, I love him. He's, he's great. He's I just wonderful. Don't remember names. He's got a a, a a just the voice that's like butter. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mm -hmm. It's so smooth. 100%. 100%. That's a good choice, right. yeah. Yeah. Uh, I will say, controversial thing, mm. but uh, ever since I heard him sing, I want him to sing more. I would stop uh, Ryan Gosling, funnily enough, with another Ryan, Ryan Reynolds. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I can see that. I just... I, I, um. I really want to see Ryan Reynolds in like a more serious role. I'm not gonna lie. I'm like, yeah, that's he's true. Funny, but like, he does. Yeah, I think he needs to stretch those acting chops out a little bit more. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I would, I would. And if you want to watch something awful, you could watch Buried. <laughs> <laughs> not to, actually, the movie is well put together. It's it is a good it is, movie. Yeah, it's it just is. it's it's just like harrowing. Oh, ugh, I could never watch that again. Never. Oh God, no, 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 no. All right, we're jumping on to the next one, okay. and it's going to be a good one mm. and a hard one. Mm. Fight Club. Ooh, okay. Mm -hmm. Instinct. I want to swap Brad Pitt out with somebody. Oh, yes. He, he is, is very good in it. But... Mm. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. I, 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 Because when I watched that movie the first time... Um, People always talk about Brad Pitt in that movie, but Edward Norton is the one that it always stands out to me. Yeah, hundred um, percent. He's fucking fantastic in it. Do you know? Actually, funny you should mention Fight Club. Um, yes. uh, my my local cinema is doing a screening of it at the beginning of September. Nice. Um, so <laughs> pretty much, go? I'm I will be going. <laughs> oh yeah, September. Sorry, I'm September. Over the place. Um, yeah. uh, it, it it was um it, it you know they sent out a little week weekly newsletter and it popped up and I was like yes. I'm, obviously, I'm going to go see. <laughs> yeah, you gotta, you gotta. I'm gonna, I, I want to see Fight Club in the cinema, but yep. um, who do I think? I'm I can... You know, I actually, as I'm looking at him, I, I think I think Brian Gosling could do that. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah. A good choice with a platinum blonde hair and all that. I don't even. It, it, it doesn't even it, like tips you know it's it's that it's the kind of sandy thing he's got going on uh in all uh, the uh, yeah. the barbie um stuff he doesn't need to be like full <laughs> <laughs> oh that's a good choice but i could yes. totally see him because you know we know he can do unhinged yes oh 100 yeah no i like that choice um mm. it's a good choice i mm. think i will just roll with that as well mm. because i'm looking at this i would never swap edward norton 
No. Nah. No. Nah. It's just too good. Helena Bonham Carter. No. Again. No. Um, no. Yeah. I, I would just draw with your choice. All right. Mm. I feel, into the... <laughs> I feel yeah. good about that one. <laughs> yeah, it's a good one. It's a good choice. Uh, jumping on the next one. It's once again, a, I would say a difficult choice on mm. who to replace. Mm. Oppenheimer. Recently. Mm. And there's so many people in that film. Mm-hmm. And so, <laughs> yeah, now I have to look up the cast. <laughs> it's a ton of people. There's a lot of people. A ton of people in there. Beep. Like, don't touch Gillian Murphy, but like. No, 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 Oh, the really funny thing would be to take Alex Wolf, swap him out for Nat Wolf, just for the sake of like, <laughs> just to be funny, really just to funny, be funny. Like, um, yeah. But that that wouldn't really wouldn't do a whole lot, really, would it? Um, I mean, there's always swapping out Josh Peck for somebody who's not quite as distracting. <laughs> There's so many people that I saw that was just sort of like, I couldn't get over the fact that jo- Drake and- <laughs> Josh from Drake and Josh was just there. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I also don't know who, because like, but he's like so. Oh, you know, swap out Casey Affleck for somebody else. Just yeah, like Casey yeah, Affleck's I not in this fucking movie. Yeah, 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 <laughs> I yeah, forgot yeah. he was there. He was there. Um, it's a small role, but still, why would you do that, Christopher Nolan? We love you, but like, come on. Mm. We swapped out Casey after <laughs> because hmm, we need you need somebody else who's like able to be like super menacing. I would tell you who I swapped him in. Yeah, go ahead. His brother. Yeah, that that did curse me. I did have the thought. I could um, put Ben in there. Like, you could put Ben in there easily. Hmm, I think so. Um, yeah. but think think about it. I don't mind. <laughs> Sorry, I just breathed. Was like, that cough? I'd like breathed incorrectly and all of it just like. Fun times. Don't mind me. Just keep dying. <laughs> Don't die, please. We need um, you. I think I might need to. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's really difficult. <laughs> that's the fun part in there. Yeah, I know. I'm just trying to think because I want to put somebody in who's kind of squirrely mm-hmm. um, and has the ability to be like really menacing, um, but a bit like what's the word I'm looking for? Um, oh Christ, my brain isn't working. Um, <laughs> Uh, unassuming, something mm-hmm. somebody kind of slightly unassuming, but actually comes across as uh, that can do like intensely menacing very well. And I can't think of who I. I feel like there's somebody that should come to mind, but I'm, I, it, like it's not, it's not there. Um. Oh, you know who else would be great? Another mm. Ben, Ben Barnes. I, I, you know, it's funny. I had the thought; it, it did, it did cross <laughs> my mind, and then I was like, I don't know. I think that baby Ben is a bit too. Pretty. <laughs> Poor Ben. <laughs> they can't even put scars on him properly. Sorry. I had to go there. <laughs> had to do that. Um you know what I mean though? Because like I yeah, think I yeah. think I think you need somebody who's a bit like creepy on the outside as well. I wasn't gonna say creepy, I was just gonna say like not like a little bit not the off looking also sounds weird. Um and yeah. rude actually. <laughs> um but like you know, not like Super traditionally handsome. Mm-hmm. Do you know? Yeah. I can't believe we're going to say this. I think Benedict Cumberbatch could do a good job, actually. Ooh. Yes. I can see Benedict in there. Because obviously, in my head, I was trying to go for somebody short. Yeah. <laughs> but, like, he's not short. But I think he I think he could do a good job with that. 100%. I like that choice. Hmm. Oh, we'll yeah, go with that I, for now. Yeah. I have three more. They're going to okay. get difficult. Because you love them. 
Okay, great. Just putting it out there. Okay. Uh, and then we, we're done. We're done with the games. Uh, all right. First one. Mm-hmm. The West Wing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Big favorite in Katie's house. Yes. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Just my life. Uh, I've got to look at the, the cast again. But like... I'm going to ignore you know the passage of time mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> just gonna, gonna put that one out there um uh we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna ignore the passage of time so um i think i want to put i want to put andrew garfield in here somewhere <gasps> yes but i can't think of who Ooh. i'd swap him with it is an interesting interesting thought oh andrew could be so good in the best thing my god mm. Oof, now I want that. <laughs> now I'm just trying to think. I'm looking at I'm looking at the list because like <sighs> there's like a couple of people I'm like not touching that. So like yeah, Alice yeah. and Jenny, John Spencer, yeah. Bradley Woodford, Martin Jean, yeah. Janelle, Richard Schiff. No. Do they? I'm just not touching any of them. You can't. You can. How about Rob Lowe? I thought about it. I thought about it. Um mm-hmm. like it could be. I almost feel like it's I don't know, there's something um hmm. I don't know, there's something about like it gets in my head it, it, the 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 timeline of it all. He still has to like end up leaving. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um True, but you know. You can put a lot into that wall, I think. Yeah. Uh, trouble with... I don't... Hmm. Because the only other one that I think of uh, would be Will Bailey, so Joshua Molina. It's mm. between the two of them. Mm-hmm. Honestly, either of them. <laughs> Swap them up with Andrew Garfield. Because we know that Andrew Garfield can do Sorkin dialogue. Because we've seen... Um, yeah. Obviously, social network. Um, yeah, either of the two of them, honestly. Fair. Also, actually, yes. yes, yes, I'm listening. Andrew Garfield or Dylan O'Brien. Oh, for either of those roles, my boy, Dylan. Yes, yes, hundred percent. Actually, I'd put. I'd. I'd probably. I'd probably swap. If I was doing it, then I'd, I'd swap. I'd swap him out for. Um, I was going to say uh, jo- um, Will Bailey, you know, mm-hmm. because he's. I think he's specifically not Jewish in this one, mm-hmm. which was like because Joshua Millian is very, um, very loud. Um, uh, he talks a lot about his Judaism on it on his Twitter and all this yeah. sort of stuff, um, and, and and that's a very important thing for him. But I think he very intentionally. It, it said to not make Will Bailey Jewish because of mm-hmm. so yeah all right we'll do it this way because I've done two now Andrew Garfield at the Sam Seaborn Dylan O'Brien as uh, Will Bailey and we'll put all it there all right I like that mm. all right I'm, I'm gonna be controversial I think but mm-hmm. I don't care I'm gonna because he's my favorite but I'm still gonna say I gonna take out Martin Sheen okay and put in Viola Davis. This is that's just what the the reboot of the West Wing. Should yeah, be. I know, <laughs> I know, I know. Like you know, if you ever want to do the West Wing again, put Viola Davis in as the president. I'm my my pitch always for the West Wing, like a West Wing reboot, is um, uh, uh, uh do they hill um Charlie Young becoming president? Good one as well. That's 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 my whole that that's my pitch. Like that that he becomes Bartlett. That that's my you know? Yeah. You yeah. know? Yeah. yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know. Fair, but uh I wanna live in the world where it's it's like, you know, Viola Davis is in there somewhere as well. Maybe if not even the president, but he's she's there. She's there. She's in she's, there. She's in there. She's I in love there. Viola Davis because she's great. She's great. All right. The next one mm. is Mm. The Witcher. Mm. 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 
Hmm. 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 Well, we're not touching Joey. <laughs> Me either, then. That was obvious. <laughs> um, I, this was not planned, by the way. I just wanted, I just, I just wanted Yaskia behind me. So there you go. Just, for, Which is for fair the, for the people watching. Um, I have to think about this actually. You do? I do. Because I think it's too obvious to switch Henry out. Because Henry's already being switched out, <laughs> right? Yeah. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. yeah um. Fair. So I want to do something a bit more interesting. Okay. Trouble is, I really like the casting on this show. Do you know I've only just realised that that Stroke of War is Lars Mikkelsen. I didn't realise that that was. That's really funny. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> just didn't. I just didn't put those together. All right. Oh, I'm really just like... wandering around. Yeah. I'm like looking at the things. That I'm like, no, I like you. Oh, you know what? Because I had a conversation okay. about this the other day. Yes. Vesemir was played by Kim uh, Bodin. B- B- Bodina? Yeah. Mm-hmm. B- B- Bodnina. No, nope. Bodina. No, Bodina. Bodina. Kim yes. Bodina. And yes. I thought he was great. But somebody pointed out Peter Stormare would make a really good Vesemir. And I'm going to put Stormare. that in there because I, I actually very much agree. I think that Peter Stormare would have killed that. Yeah. Kim, yeah, Kim Bodina was, was excellent. I and mean, it was a really great Vesemir. But see, Peter Stormare could do a really good job as well. Mm. Mm. So we'll do that. <laughs> fair, you know, that's fair. Peter Stormer just makes everything better. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Lie there. All right, you know me. Mm-hmm. I'm still going to say Henry Cavill. <laughs> sure. Okay. No, I'm, <laughs> but I'm curious as to who you put in instead. All right, it's uh, it's the one who would make me watch the whole thing. Mm. Chris Evans. I, well, I suppose that really in Hemsworth is also very pretty, so that doesn't really count i don't watch it with chris evans i mean fair i understand it dialect, it's, but... it's it's like just based on that, that understandable it's... in my head yeah. i'm looking and i'm like thinking about his face shape i'm like his face shape's wrong for it though yeah but imagine that long white hair on him i know but he's like his his face is so it's very round every both yeah. both henry and liam have like really square heads you That's know true. yeah and I think that there's something about that that is intently <laughs> Geralt to me. Yeah, but he looks so good with that beard in in um, Infinity War that uh, I want a bearded, long, white head Chris Simmons. Yeah, you know that people are going to start yelling if they start putting a beard on him. Though. Okay, yeah, exactly. It's just beautiful. Beautiful. All right, and then we are arriving to the last one. It's something that we both watched again. It's Shadow and Boom. Mm. So, so much of the casting in Shadow and Boom was re- again re- really good. Fair. Um, I'm guessing you're switching out, um, Nikolai. Yes. Right. Okay. <laughs> uh, so I just know you. It's, you do. <laughs> I just know. I know. Um, I'm trying to think who else. Uh. I really like a lot of the choices that they made. Mm-hmm. When touching, I don't think I touched any of the crows because I think they did that. But yeah, that's good. Pretty, enough, pretty yeah. spectacular. It's pretty, yeah. se- pretty spectacularly. Well done. <laughs> English is hard. <laughs> I can't speak. <laughs> mm. Mm. Choices, choice. choices, 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 choices. It's quite difficult. I can't think of anybody that I was like. Only person that kind of hmm. pops up might be Mal, and not saying anything okay. bad about Archie because Archie yeah. did a really great job. I did, I did really like him, but yes, I don't know who I'd swap him with though. Hmm. I'm trying to think of who else was a. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> this episode is just mm, ah, mm, mm, mm. Ah. <laughs> just enjoy if if you're listening on a podcast and you have like headphones on or earphones in just just listen to the mm, ah, mm. <laughs> <laughs> ASMR wind howling um, yeah I feel like he's the only one that I can think of that I would want to swap out well, well. But, but I also I don't I don't know who I do it with. <laughs> I 
I want to hear who you'd swap out um, Patrick Gibson uh, for Nikolai. Well, it's a very easy choice. Mm. It, it, it has to be Dylan O'Brien. I... <sighs> Acting yes. wise, sure. Yeah, but he's not. You can do it easily. But it, Nikolai's got such a, like a specific look about him. He's not like Dylan's got such dark features. Yeah. Nikolai's not got dark features. He's a golden boy. He can be a golden boy as well. I don't think it would suit him. I think it would. I would love to see Dylan as Nikolai. I'm not gonna lie. Mm. That's the fun and within him, like the gliders, he, he, he can easily pull off that <sighs> vibe for me, <sighs> at least. <sighs> okay, least. okay, okay. No, I, 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 I get where you're coming from. I don't think I agree, but I get okay. where you're coming from. Yeah. Um. No. Yeah. Nikolai's. Um. Nikolai's energy and his charm is a different vibe in, for me than mm-hmm. than Dylan's. Like the, mm-hmm. the the they're just different things. Yeah. Um, who could play Mal? <laughs> Squinting. <laughs> who could do it? A uh, young Ryan Gosling. <laughs> yeah, kind of. <laughs> to be honest, that's not a bad shout. <laughs> there you go. I have good ideas sometimes. Yeah, you're really young. Um, yeah, TV really young. Ryan right? Gosling. Yeah, Ryan Gosling when as he appears in the X Files, you know. <laughs> it, was, he? it was Ryan Gosling in the X Files, wasn't it? I was think it, so. Yeah. Was it Ryan Reynolds? Oh no! Oh no! They're both he, Canadian. <laughs> Ryan Gosling was the young Hercules, so you know that's how I know him. I, I'm I'm old. I know. Shut up. <laughs> I I um no, I'm starting to think that that was um that was Ryan, Ryan Reynolds. Reynolds. Maybe. He was in an episode of the of the, the X Files, and he like he died quite early on. And I'm thinking, oh, oh no, I think it, I think it was Ryan Reynolds. You know, but Ryan, young Ryan Reynolds could be good as well as well. Let's be fair. Yeah, it was Ryan Reynolds. There you go. He could, he could be good as, as well. <sighs> Gosh, yeah. Mm. Just put the Ryans in everything. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm thinking about Mel's like energy and. Who would put in there? I don't know. You don't know. I don't know. All right. I don't really. I don't, I don't have an answer for this one because I'm really looking at all these and I'm like, I like all the choices. <laughs> Just fair. The other side of it. Do you know what? Yes. Do you know Tell what? Me. Tell me. Actually, mm-hmm. I think mm. Joey could do a very good Nikolai. I do, I, re- I do think he could. I think he could do a really good Nikolai. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can move with that. Um, I was also sitting there like, can I put Joey in any of these and make it work? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. yeah, yeah. We'll go with that. Yeah, but I'm also. I actually really like. I think Patrick Gibson does a great job as Nikolai. I think he's great as an actor. I just, I he couldn't convince me. Like after reading the book, I was like, "Nah." <laughs> so I he... think, for me, he he captures a lot of the Nikolai that I see in in the last two books. Oh, uh, the in King in, of in, Scars in, in and Kings of Scars and, and Rule of Wolves. Yeah, but this should be like, you know, the Nikolai from the Shadow and Bone trilogy. I get that he's going through like a change and everything, but like, <laughs> oh yeah, I know. I just yeah, I think he. Yeah, no, he's he's the Nikolai that because you spend a lot more time with him, obviously, in those books. Obviously. So you know, th- that's the version of him that exists in my head, and I'm like, mm. yeah, no, mm. he did he did good there. Okay. It's just a shame that they <laughs> <laughs> just like the fuck at the end of that season, and, and and the fact that they like he's meant to be the smartest person in the room, and then they just have him like running away from stuff. I'm yeah. like, come on, mm-hmm. <laughs> it's fine. If if you want to hear our ranting about the season two, we have that as well in the description. We have that. It's yeah. to watch. Uh, you can go and check it out. Uh, all right, so this was us doing like a little game again, mm-hmm. uh, and then we're gonna be back next week with uh, a little special edition. 
I, I don't know why I say it like that. It's fine. Uh, <laughs> I'm suddenly um, like, <laughs> I can't remember. What. You wrote the email. I, can't I know I did. I just don't, rem- I couldn't remember the look date. At, <laughs> look at this woman. Look at this woman. Uh, all right. So we're going to be back. Uh, so don't worry. Once again, thank you for all the views we're getting from you guys. You are all great. Again. Okay. It's last week. Sorry, I just my, my dates were all over the place. It's, I, I, I'm, it's, I'm, it's I've got you get it. Yeah, we got it, something interesting coming up. Interesting. Uh, yeah, uh, leave comments as well. We read them and we answer. Yeah, mm-hmm. so just you know, type in your thoughts. We like mm-hmm. thoughts. Mm-hmm. Uh, and yeah, if you want to see us more, then subscribe and you know follow us on Spotify or whatever you listen to podcasts to your podcast platform of choice. Yeah. Exactly. And uh, we will see you next week. Yes. Love you all. Watch movies. Yes. Watch movies. Bye.